I'm just going to, you know, bring this up or highlight every time you started talking, you kept going up to the right, kept going up to the right. So that was you going after whatever information it was. And I just kept watching. And every time you started to really talk about it, you kept going up to the right. And that's why I eventually invited you to go, oh, did you notice that you're going up to the right? And you said, no, I, I didn't. I said, well, let's, let's just try that. And then um, as we're coming up here, you're like, you were really surprised that you were at a seven because you thought it was a low level of anxiety. And we zero out of 10, a seven's pretty high. Okay, well, thank you for the opportunity to um, demonstrate, you know, brain spotting. And do you have any questions before we get started? Uh, I don't think so. I'm, I'm very curious to see how brain spotting works online, but I think I'll just find out as we go along. Okay, well, I have a few questions if, that, if that's okay before we, before we jump in. Absolutely. Okay, so in terms of comfortability with vulnerability, where would you rate yourself in terms of being comfortable with vulnerability? Highly comfortable. Okay, wonderful. So that's that's a really um, important, you know, I, I don't necessarily come right out and ask uh, my clients that. I kind of feel into that. We call that attunement mm -hmm. um, to let the clients know where they might be going, that brain spotting um, for effectiveness, really, we encourage um, vulnerability and surrendering to your process. So whatever you're um, observing in your process, to try not to analyze it, try not to um, problem solve it, um, but to instead um, just notice with curiosity and see where it takes you. Okay. I just want to share a, a little bit about why I started out that way with you. Um, it, it, you know, I had only met you. That was the first time meeting you. And so part of getting somebody prepared for, for brain spotting is to talk with them, get attuned. What we use, we use a term called attunement and feel into the person um, and then ask them some questions. And so I was asking about your, you know, comfortability with vulnerability, um, because that tells me a lot about you. Um, and, and it also kind of gives me a clinical idea of kind of what method of brain spotting we might use. So for folks, like if you would have answered me and said, uh, I get really nervous about vulnerability, and that's probably not the it's not my forte or I, I don't do that. I might have chosen what we call outside window uh, brain spotting, which would have meant me using a pointer. You can't really see it in my blur here, but it's a pointer. I'll show it to you here where it goes across the screen and I'm looking at your reflexes um, based on what you wanted to work on. In this circumstance, because you were saying, yeah, I'm pretty comfortable with it we went with more, more of a, a free flowing brain spotting, which was called gaze spotting, G-A-Z-E. Because I could see you were a curious person, you were open. And so I was matching you with what you were telling me about yourself. And so I just sat there and I was watching, um, we're gonna see this next, where your eyes went while you were talking about the issue you wanted to work with. 